Hi guys, welcome to Lee and Toon's channel and the roof and the ends are on the outside kitchen. Check it out. Chuff to pieces. Ends all blocked in. I'm just going to do like a bamboo handrail all the way around the outside, just a probably a meter high. Excellent, excellent shaded area. So the midday sun shouldn't be too much of an issue now. Two days to fit. So what lays ahead? So today the builder and his crew are gonna block in this end with the same same boards as we've got there. And then he's gonna move all the scaffolding inside and once he's got the metal going to start prepping for the ceiling tiles in the house. So it's going to be level with the top of the walls all the way round. Nice blue roof, just got it laid and then about one minute afterwards that farm there and that farm there decided to burn their sugar cane off before they chopped it all down so well this one they, they chopped it first about a week ago laid everything down and then burnt it off which isn't too bad but over that side as most of them do it they just torched it I'll tell you what it was a bit it was a bit hairy uh, but that's what they do out here Nearly all of them have done it like that for decades, so can't moan. But it's a hell of a noise as well, but what it creates is like a black snow. I'll try and find you a bit of it. Luckily, me and Toon hadn't been um, painting, otherwise, it would have been shipped to a blanket. Let's have a look. So the sky is just filled with this stuff and then nice. We've got a roof full of that. Thankfully we haven't put the gutters on yet. So the plan is gutter all the way along and then feeding into a big water tank this end and then the same that end. Because it's what four, eight, twelve, fourteen meters long. So when you get a really heavy downpour, I wouldn't want to trust one, one downpipe. And we've got a similar size roof, spec roof on the other house in the village and it hasn't overflowed, but I don't want to take chances. So uh, that's the plan there. And then the other good news was the solar company turned up. They were just waiting for this to be finished because you'll see that these are a different roofing material to the rest of the, the buildings. We couldn't put the zinc roof on this one because it cooks your solar panels. So they said, right, once you've got your normal roof tiles on one building, we'll come and give you a price. So they came yesterday afternoon with a famous tie actor as well, I hasten to add. 
Shy or Shay or something like that. Tomb recognised him and asked if it was him and it was. Apparently he's been in some big films. Uh, he's the neighbour of the company that turned up and they gave us a price for the whole install which was off the top of my head 130,000 uh, and then that is going to start when is it within a week so what we and Tune have got to organise or, or do ourselves before then is prep all the electrics so wire everything up so want a few lights in there and a couple of uh, certainly some sockets in that far one that might be my little workshop that's a storeroom that's where we're housing the batteries we okayed that with them that's not a problem uh, a few lights in this area and probably one socket lights and various sockets in Toon's kitchen just lights in there and then I think we're going to have an outside socket down here so we're going to lay some cable in to go underneath the tiles uh, and then that can feed the pump we're going to put I think we're going to put a little ornamental pump in there and put Toon's snake of god statue in there with a spout going in there, so that should look quite nice. And then um, we've got to prep all the cabling all the way along the top and then put it in a protective uh, tubing and then put it down the, the walls ready to plug into the sockets. And then I think we're going to have the, a fuse box there. So by the time that they come in a week or so, all they're doing is setting up everything on there, set up the battery bank, and then plug into the fuse box. So electrics lay ahead. Toon asked me if I trust her doing electrics. Of course I do. She's better than the last ele electrician we had. Oh, the metal's come. Good stuff. Okay, guys. Thanks for tuning in. We'll give you another update soon. Cheers then. Bye-bye.